Good evening, thanks for joining us. I'm Dustin Lukey. Many people, of course, consider this area a great place to live. And now a top national business publication says we've got some of the top rated employers. News 19's Colton Emsweiler joins us now in Colton, a pair of area businesses claiming those top spots. That they are, Dustin. Mayo Clinic Health Systems and Quick Trip were named the top two employers in the state of Wisconsin, and these rankings come from Forbes. The Business Journal conducted surveys to find the top businesses in every state, plus DC, and made their decisions based on the results of 70,000 employee submissions, taking into consideration workplace safety and a whole lot more. When it comes to the healthcare provider, burnout was very real during the pandemic, but Mayo did its part to make sure their workers had the motivation to battle the virus and enjoy going to the office around fellow employees. You know, we try to create the best environment that we can for our employees to work in with competitive compensation, opportunities for advancement. And so I think at the end of the day, as long as you're taking care of your employees and um, giving them what they need to take care of our patients, that really is what sets us apart. And not to be outdone is lacrosse based quick trip at number two. Around 36,000 employees show up to work every day. The most notable benefit for them comes in the form of compensation as 40% of the company's profits go directly back to their staff. But quick trip says the money goes even farther than that. I think a big piece for us here at Quick Trip in the fact that our employees are so satisfied is the fact that the profits come back to all of them. You know, we're not lining the pockets of some rich CEO someplace. Uh, last year, all of us received a 12% cash bonus, 5% in our 401k, even if we were part-time. The profits come back to us, and I think that makes a difference. And a big reason for Quick Trip's silver medal could be the company's expansion efforts. McHugh says they open 50 stores a year. That's basically one a week. And Dustin, while some people may love their small businesses, the Forbes rankings only consider companies with more than 500 employees. Yeah, some nice honors there. Thank you, Colton. Mayo also faring well in other states, getting tops in Arizona in third in Minnesota, where its main Rochester campus is located.